This is the land I grew up in. It's mostly flat, with a few hills. And no mountains for hundreds of miles. see my first mountain until I was 12 years old and all my family holidays as a child were always by the ocean. And it wasn't until I was 14 that I picked up the family for the first time. Since then, I've been lucky enough to do ski and surf seasons in New Zealand. But I've always dreamt of going to British Columbia to explore the legendary powder. This film is about skiing. But more than that, it's a record of the people I meet and the memories we make along the way. My first two weeks in Canada presented some of the best conditions I have ever experienced. Dry, fluffy snow and champagne powder were the order of the days. And in that time, I entered more white rooms than I can remember.
With the snow came record cold temperatures for parts of British Columbia, with an Arctic front bringing temperatures of minus 27 degrees Celsius on Revelstoke Mountain. And within those first two weeks, I'd already met some awesome people. Meet Robin, Lisa, Ebba and Karen. Four Swedish riders who I came to spend some great times with. day together we decided to take advantage of fresh tracks and head up onto the mountain early to get the 10 centimeter of power that fell overnight it didn't disappoint The next few weeks proceeded to bring intermittent periods of snow, but clouds sat stubbornly on the summits of the mountains. However, eventually, towards the end of January, the clouds finally parted for a time and the mountains gave up their secrets.
The blue skies didn't last long, and by the second week of February, the snow had returned. And with it came an entirely new group of people to go riding with.
with the arrival of March, conditions in Revelstoke started to change. The freezing level slowly crept up the mountains and it was clear spring was just around the corner. Despite this, the conditions in the higher elevations stayed good. And I arguably met some of the most talented riders of my season. And this segment is for them. Woo! <laughs>